C88. Hello everyone and welcome back to Starfield. My name is Horos88 and today we have finished uh, settling down in the constellation um, edifice. <laughs> um, the constellation um, room, I don't know how to call it, main quarters. Yeah, that sounds about right. My parents are here. I'm planning Hi, a grocery run later. I get some things you like. Thanks, Mom. Hi, Dad. I figured it would be years until I saw you again. And here you are. Here I am. Thanks, Dad. All right. Uh, so, yeah, we are starting a new mission today. We have the mission called The Old Neighborhood. And it starts by talking to Sarah. I think we already sent uh, Vasco to our ship. He's now officially a uh, recruit there. Well, not a recruit, but an employee. So let's let's just begin and let's talk to Sarah and see what she has for us. So, are you ready to get to work? Or was there something else? Um... Huh. Okay, how well known is Constellation? It's something I don't know I what like you've heard, know. but I can imagine. First of all, I think you can dismiss any stories about us no longer existing. Hmm? Sure. I don't believe in smearing our name everywhere we can. Exploring the universe, charting the unknown, that's what counts. Besides, having a little mystery gives us room to maneuver. A fixed reputation could fence us in a lot of ways. Sure. What do you know about the artifacts? Not much, but you've seen them for yourself. It doesn't take a lot to realize we're dealing with something extraordinary. Just what that is, we'll have to figure out. It's what we do. All right, well, I think I'm ready. We're going to be doing some old-fashioned detective work. The artifacts are relatively inert once they're out of bedrock. That means people can pass them around not even knowing what they are. I've been letting my contacts know to be on the lookout for strange metal objects. Get back a lot of noise, usually, but a tip from the UC Vanguard sounds promising. Okay. Um, the UC Vanguard? A volunteer force that helps defend the edges of United Colonies. Oh, space. yeah, that's what. They're okay. always looking for recruits. Lots of retired veterans and dangerous professionals mixed in with part timers who barely have a laser cannon welded to a hull. My contact is in the recruiting office, so he hears a lot about what the volunteers are up to. Yeah, that's that's the same uh, thing that we looked at, uh, I think, last episode or two episodes back, where we can get a, citizens, uh, a citizenship from New Atlantis by going to the Vanguard. Uh, other people have artifacts? We have to assume that we're not the only ones to have stumbled into this mystery. But most people aren't going into space looking for the unknown. They're looking for places to settle, resource to extract, territory to defend. An odd-looking rock or a single strange hunk of metal wouldn't mean much to them. That's why Constellation exists, in a way. To put pieces like this together. Okay. Um, well. Have to admit, I'm excited. My first mission. Felt the same way when I started, too. There's an electricity in the air when you know you're about to uncover something. But it's not just that. I want to take this opportunity to see how you handle yourself and for you to learn more about us. Okay. I'm going to be sticking with you for this. We'll be traveling together until we either find an artifact or this lead runs dry. Sure. Sada will be locked as your follower if you continue. Okay. Got it. You and me until we get that artifact. Um. Ah, uh, yeah, sure. We'll need to head to Mast. Check in with the Vanguard recruiting office where my contact works. And listen, whatever you were before or whatever you do once you're out there, I don't care. So long as you don't bring UC security to our doorstep. Every member of Constellation is their own conscience. Understood? Yes, ma'am. Good. Let's take a little stroll through New Atlantis, shall we? Okay. Sarah Morgan can't be dismissed until the old neighborhood is done, okay. So she's my companion now. 
I guess. Now where? Oh, she's just gonna follow me? I know everyone's excited by the artifacts, yeah. but we need to be as objective as possible. Okay. Whew. I actually am excited. This first actual mission, it's kind of interesting. Let's see where it goes. Oh, you can actually go up here. <laughs> I really didn't even notice. Wait, but then how do I get back? <laughs> oh, this crosses town. No, oh, yeah, I, I should. I should go down first. Among the stars, a universe of leisure. And what is this? Trident? Trident looks through lines. Here's Mast. Are you coming or what? Thank you for the best of your abilities and to uphold the values of the Vanguard. Honor, royalty, self-reliance in all your actions as members of the United Colonies Navy. I, I do. do. Then I'm proud to welcome you to the Vanguard. Now, you all have your assignments. Get out there and show them what the UC is made of. Supra et ultra. Nice. Cool stuff. Welcome to Mast. If you have an appointment, you may proceed inside. Thank you. Who is this guy? <laughs> he looks so unique. Sarah, good to see you. Who's your friend? Hopefully Constellation's newest member. Thought I'd run through some legwork together. Uh, another space explorer. Mm -hmm. Hey, you ever think of joining up with the Vanguard? Help the United Colonies, earn some credits, even get your UC citizenship? I mean, I have think, I have thought about it. Uh, uh, no thanks, I'd rather chart stars than fight wars. I mean, what's the Vanguard first? United Colonies volunteer fleet. Independent captains enlist, get to use their own ships. And the UC provides them with sustained work and credits. And put in your time and you're guaranteed UC citizenship and everything that comes with it. Discounts on UC goods and medical services, chance to own a place in New Atlantis. Only way a foreign captain could even dream of seeing those sorts of benefits. So, you want in? Um, uh, I don't know. Maybe later we have Constellation business to discuss first. All right, all right. Can't blame me for trying, right? Yeah. I mean, I still haven't given up on getting Sarah to re-enlist. It's a game we play. He asks. I say no. <laughs> Here's what I got for you two. Vanguard volunteer by the name of Moera. Helps patrol the old neighborhood. Sol, Mars, Neptune, you know. The Sol system? Which Admiral did he upset to get that posting? He's Martian, born and raised. Not like I can get anyone else to care. Word is he's got some fancy metal ornament he's been showing off to the old grounders. Matches that description Sarah gave me. Oh. Uh. Okay. Wait, what's wrong with the soul system? You kidding? Lowest posting request rate in the whole fleet. Only thing there the UC cares about is Mars. And no one wants to go to Mars. They want to get off Mars. <laughs> Who's this Moara? Oh, he goes way back. I think he was recruit number 81 or something. 
If he's on patrol, he could be putting our item at risk. Uh, we'll talk to him, I'm sure we can make him a good offer for it. Yeah, sure. Soul system is a lot of planets, but a vet like Moera will be checking in at Sidonia on the regular. You mean hitting the bars, don't you, John? Hey, nothing wrong with a little refresh between patrols. Okay. Anything you can tell me about Sidonia? Yeah, bring a coloring book. Get so used to seeing red, you'll forget what blues and greens look like. <laughs> Did Moira say where he found this ornament of, the, of his? You'll have to ask him. But Vanguard volunteers have retrieval rights if they get into a scrap. Wouldn't be surprised if he found it off of a pirate or something like that. Sure. Uh, thank you for all your help, Ian. Anything for Sarah. UC always takes care of its own. Even the prodigal children. No, brother. <laughs> I'm serious about that recruitment offer, by the way. You just come talk to me when you're ready. UC is a good friend to have. Yeah, I'll think about that. Okay, ask about more uh, in Sidonia. So, where should we go now? Speak to Commander Tuala about joining the Vanguard. Oh, okay, but that's an activity. Okay. So now... Oh, we take the vat. Okay, okay, okay. How do we get into the vat, though? No, this is not the way. Oh, we just go down here. Okay, okay, yeah. I remember. I kinda remember. This place at night also looks beautiful. Look at this. Okay, so to the spaceport, I think. Oh, she didn't even go down. <laughs> She just, she just stood there. Oh my god! <laughs> I've flown across most of the settled systems in all manners of spacecraft, and yet I still get sick on the nat. Oh, sorry. Ho hopefully, it wasn't that bad. Port. I love the design of this game, man. Security scans, chemical scans, and polymer strings and technologies. off when you are captain oh she's called me captain check out your ship's inventory okay how do I do that um. oh okay cargo hold um Okay, so this is the frontier. We have alkanes, aluminum, um beryllium, copper, fiber, iron, isotopic coolant, lead, lubricant, nickel, sealant, ship parts. Um silver, tungsten and zero G 
gimbal. So it has a mass of 450 carry-on. Maybe I actually kinda... I actually have the chance to maybe put all of this here. Okay, the ammo I do have to get here. Um, eight notes, resources. Store all of this. Wow, it was carrying a lot. And the miscellaneous as well. So far, yeah. Okay. So now I only have the throwballs, the ammo, spacesuit, packs, helmets, all the necessary stuff for us to actually do the mission here. So yeah. Um, let's see, there was another activity. I already did that. Um, okay, ask about more in Sidonia. I love the cinematics here, like this small cut. Alright, so now I'm guessing we can just go here and look at the map. And then we go to Seoul. Clear route, fuel consumption, okay, not so much. Let's jump. Power up, grab drive. Oh, uh, okay, so maybe we drop some of ballistics. Just one, missiles as well. <laughs> this is UC security. Prepare to be scanned for contraband. Sure. Scan complete. Welcome to Mars. Oh, I'm level four. Wait, I didn't even realize. That was level 3. <laughs> okay. Sure. Uh, now let's see. We're at Mars. Oh, we do have resources here. Nice, nice. Mars Mech Factory, fracking station, another fracking station. So I guess let's just go to Sidonia. The rocky desert. Hmm. Trades one oh two resources zero four. Okay, let's land inside of. Oh, 
God, this looks amazing. When humanity was forced to leave Earth, the colonies quickly band to banded together to form the United Colonies. Definitely stock up on supplies for exchange. Hello. Okay. So down your location discovered. Frankly, I'm a bit surprised to find such a delightful spot in this rather drab city. Oh, uh over here, I guess. <laughs> this actually reminds me of the movie from Arnold Schwarzenegger. I don't know how that was called, but he basically saved Mars population. Mining colony of Cydonia, uh, established 2112 by Deimos Stargirds Incorporated to advance industry and security for humanity throughout the galaxy. To main airlock. Take care of your ship. Building Cydonia completely underground was a clever way of keeping the city shielded from the harsh Martian landscape. Okay. Hours without incident. So the split runs by hours without incident. Jesus. Am I glad I got this job instead of mining some dead rock out in the middle of nowhere? Sure. Just passing through or here to stay? Keep it simple or keep to yourself. Whatever you be it. Want to catch yourself with a loose grip on your equipment when one of those particle detonations goes off? Got cold beers and good atmosphere. We get a lot of new faces passing through here. I'd like a drink. What's your poison? All right, let's see. Uh I guess... Guess we'll go with this one. Why not? Uh, sure. I'm looking for a banker named Mora. He ain't been around. Went off on patrol. Hasn't been back in since. We're starting to think it might be time to pour one out to the blackest sea. Damn. Seriously? Wait, the blackest sea? You got another word for it? He means outer space. Ma'am. Sure. We could track you down, uh... If you know his patrol route. I oh, believe me, I've heard it. 
After about round three or four was all he would talk about. He's got a voice that carries. Look, nothing more I'd love than to help out a fellow Martian. Especially one that's missing. But... <clears throat> He has a tab, and you don't know if he's coming back. <laughs> it's a lot of credits, okay? I let it slide for a long time because he's a regular, but... If I'm out all that money, I got problems. What do you say? 2,050 credits! Jesus Christ! Uh, your companion can speak on your behalf. What they will say is written next to their name. Okay. Skip to the part where you admit you're lying. Oh shit. He could need help. You shouldn't put a price on that. I mean, let's try. Come on. Life on Sidonia ain't hard enough. You gonna guilt trip me? <laughs> uh, what matters to you more? The money or more of life? Uh, nobody will ever know you told me a promise and I want you to imagine him out there alone and there no yeah 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 I'll get your boy I'm not leaving until you tell me what I want to know We could be the only ones who could find him I want you to imagine yeah, we could be the only ones who, who can find him And maybe he's not gonna get found I'm out the cash either way Yeah there must be some way we can both win here. There's no reason for us to have a problem, is there? You may I'm think failing so. this like hell. That's enough. You either pay up or get out. I'm done talking about this. Yeah. I mean, sure. Let me confirm you now. Okay. Let's talk. Last time he was here, Moera kept yelling about the Lady of Love, <laughs> singing songs, all that kind of thing. Venus? That's only one planet. Hardly an entire patrol route. I got what I got, okay? <sighs> Fine. We'll make do. Okay, I got scammed. <laughs> to Mars, they say. The bay is great, they say. So is the crippling depression. Okay, so let's go to Venus, I guess. <laughs> I just got ripped off. But I mean, I think I'm doing the right thing, so... I'll go with that. Love the landscape of all these planets so far. Who would have thought Mars would look like this? Now off to Venus to keep track of this uh, this lost soldier, and I guess that's it for today's episode, guys. We are actually going to leave it here. I really hope you're enjoying, and if you are, please consider leaving a like and maybe subscribing to my channel. And I'll see you in the next one. See ya.